Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Ladessa. We have put Mr. Down. Unless he wants to pop back in, we'll give you an addition of the Kookie and Mr. Show. But for now, it's just me and you. I'm going to give you a moment to hit that uh, subscribe button and hit that notification button so you'll know when I'm uh, popping in to say what's up while I take a sip of my fruit infused uh, green tea. Go ahead. That's good, right? Mm, try it. It's really good. I am on the Whole30 uh, diet. I don't want to call it a diet, but I'm doing the Whole30 program. And so no sugar of any kind. So I just put some fruit in here just to kind of give me a flavorful uh, taste to my green tea. But I wanted to just pop in here and explore a concept with you. If you've ever worked in corporate America, you have heard the concept of having to dress up because it is the thinking of your company that you will be more productive when you are in business casual or professional wear. And so because I work from home, I think I shared that with you all on the last video, I want to explore that concept. I will not be getting in full regalia, but I did get up and... Um, transition out of leggings <laughs> or yoga pants and a t-shirt and a head rag or bonnet and got myself together. I curled my hair. I have a few rollers in there to hold in place because my hair does not hold a curl. That's another show, uh, another topic rather. And put my makeup on. I didn't have time to put my makeup on, put my makeup on, excuse me, on camera uh, because I got to get to work. So I've got my tea, I've got my apple, and uh, I'm going to take my rollers out, and then I'm going to pop back in at the end of the day and let you know, was my day more productive now that I'm, you know, all dolled up? So let's see. I uh, have already contoured. I'm going to put on a little bit of my, uh, can you see that? Oh, it's kind of. Fingerprint it up because I've been in it so much since I've gotten it. But my uh, Artist Couture, uh, there we go, Artist Couture Jackie Ina collaboration of their Diamond Glow Powder. This is in the uh, La Bronze color. I'm going to tap that in a little bit right here at my, uh, right at the top of my cheekbone. Uh, put my lip gloss on. Well, this isn't a lip gloss. This is the uh retro matte liquid lip color by mac and choco teas put that on and take my hair down and then get myself together i gotta get to work child so do you guys have big plans for the weekend i don't really have oh this stuff is so pretty and a little bit goes a long way can you see it Focus in on it. Yeah, I'm going to Atlanta for the weekend to babysit my grandbaby, who I just sent home. Lord have mercy. I can't escape that little girl. Um, I love her so much, though. Um, and I'm actually only going for a day. My oldest daughter... Oh my God, that's so gorgeous. My oldest daughter is turning 25 on Sunday and my parents are out of town who would normally watch her. Um, they are out of town and um, she couldn't find anybody to watch the baby on Saturday night. So I am popping in Saturday afternoon to turn right around and come back uh, Sunday afternoon so she can have a good time, her and my niece. My niece's birthday is today. Happy birthday, Lisa Mason. And uh, just gonna let that sit a little bit before I, oh, excuse me, before I set and forget. Um, let me go in my brows. I have this one little area right in here that never 
um, that always feels knit. I don't know how to color in my brows, so I just use this e.l.f. Uh, brow pen. Uh oh, wrong way. The e.l.f. brow pencil. Can you see that? The e.l.f. brow pencil in natural brown and just kind of give me a little uh, fill in. I actually need to get my eyebrows done, but I'm holding out on doing that to see if I can get them a little thicker before I go off to the Dominican Republic with some girlfriends. Girl strip. Can you see that? Oh, that's pretty. Okay, I've got to get it together. So let's take this hair down and uh, get it cracking. And like I said, I will pop back in here at the end of my work day and let you know was i more productive or um will i go back to my uniform i don't know if i mentioned it already because my mind is on the things that i need to do today but uh i have cornered the market on leggings and yoga pants and despite the comedian d ray and his thinking there's this joke that he has that says dudes should mess with chicks that uh, know where all the good leggings are. Despite him thinking that, I think that you should mess with your girl. Your girl is uh, all right. And uh, yeah, I have cornered the market on um, yoga pants and the like. And I'll drop in a picture of what my day normally looks like or what I normally look like. Uh, during the day unless I have to go out into the field and uh, hold on I dropped my cup go out into the field I'll show you what I look like it's not a picture of me it's a stock photo that I found online but it's uh, pretty uh, accurate on what your girl is looking like or what I normally look like when I um work from home and my day consists of getting up in the morning I'm on a prayer call with my mom and some other ladies so that is my alarm clock start my day off with Jesus and uh, then I uh, do the two things that you must do as a as a black person I can't speak to other nationalities but uh, you have two things that you must do when bef uh, when your feet hit the floor before you take a shower. You have to uh, wash your face and uh, brush your teeth. I think I have a little bit too much volume right in here. Um, and so after I do that, uh, wash my face and brush my teeth and jump in the shower. It's breakfast, some tea, and... Uh, putting in that username and password. I, I think I might do a lot of work today. That bang is a little thicker than um, I would like it to be because I have my rollers in longer than I anticipated. But um, I think I think I might be on to something. What is this, 19, uh, <laughs> 1957? If you are in my age group, um, do you remember this? Your grandma or your mom doing this? Brushing back and then doing that? <laughs> oh my God. I love a hefty bang though. Okay, there we go. All right, so I've got to get it together. I slicked down my edges, but I don't have a perm. And uh, as hard as I might try to do all the things that the uh, the natural naturalistas do, my hair will not act right with a act right with a twist out and braid out and all those uh, lovely things. So I usually have to uh, put my hair up in some kind of bun and uh, or flat iron it so I just have the uh, bragging rights of saying uh, team natural but um, yeah I'm still uh, looking like creamy crack all right so 
So I do maybe like four times a year, like once a quarter. Uh, well, a quarter is four, so three times a year. Um, at the season change, basically. Um, slick down my edges with like a mild relaxer just so um, it'll lay down. And so the last time I did that was in October, right before we went out of town for my birthday. This is really higher than I wanted it to be. But okay, I've got to get to work because I'm officially about 10 minutes late for work. Luckily, I have one of those jobs where they're not monitoring you. My boss is like super cool that way. But I'll just make it up at the end of the day. What is this on my... All right, so here we go. Put this on. Uh, did I show this already to you? Yeah, matte, matte, excuse me, retro matte lip color, liquid lip color in Choco Tea. Where, where are you going? Where are you going? But I'm I'm committed to this, to this experiment. So I'm wanting to look my best. All right, so I'm going to put a little bit right here. Ooh, that dries really fast, but I think it's so pretty. I'm going to put a little bit of that at my cupids, though, and fix this. If this thing works out, I may uh, be doing this often. Not every day. That's not me. Because mother is um, needing her rest in these and in, in these her uh, fine years of living. So I'm gonna just take a little. Diamond glow and put that on my cupid's bow and get myself together because just a few minutes ago I said I was 10 minutes late. I'm running into almost lunchtime now. Okay, I have played in this hair. And am going absolutely nowhere. I have played in this hair long enough. But you all get the concept. So I will let you all know shortly after five how my day went. Was I productive? Does this concept work for those of us that work at home? And if I see a difference in my productivity and how I feel about my work day and... um my aggravation level is lower um, when I'm talking to these crazy people that I have to talk to on the phone. I may incorporate this uh, once a week. So I will see you guys at the end of the day. This is what I wore today. Just a simple track suit and not a wrinkled t-shirt and leggings. Little Fila track suit. I got my earrings and accessories on. I do work from home, so I couldn't go all the way in. So I still got my slippers on. All right, guys. So end of the day, and I don't feel like I worked smarter or harder or anything like that. It was just a typical day. I did feel uh, a lot better, though. I, you know, I you know, as I went to the bathroom, I took a little longer glance in the mirror and I did feel better um, about myself today. So I think I'm going to try this out, you know, once a week, get up and get myself together and uh, log on and uh, get my work day done. So don't forget to uh, like, subscribe. I really hope that you all enjoy this uh concept and just enjoy getting to know me better and i'll see you next time
I said like and subscribe, right? Like, subscribe, turn on that notification button so you know when I'm here. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.